In this video, we will focus on the free version of the Zip WP AI WordPress Builder. In the free version, we're kind of limited, but we can just start playing around and create some basic WordPress websites using the power of AI. Let's go and see how it works. My name is Pascal and I'm the creator of WP Roads, the YouTube channel where I share my knowledge and passion about WordPress. So if you like this kind of content, don't hesitate to subscribe and hit the like button. Now let's see what can I do with the free version of Zip WP. This is quite interesting because we can test out some of the functionalities of this new AI builder. The first thing we can do is to create, for example, a staging site. If we go here and click on create new, we can create a blank website, which is the same link uh, as that we can find here on the left side. So basically here we have just uh, different ways to reach this uh, functionality, create a blank site. If we use this, uh, this is kind of, of kind of a simple test that we can use and this will create an empty website, uh, simply free uh, empty WordPress installation. So I make WP Roads test site. Then I go here, it is not a multi-site and I'm not using a blueprint and okay, create site. In a few seconds, I can click here to log into my website. This is quite amazing. Yes, yeah, even, yeah, it was half, a, half of a second. Wow, <laughs> this is my staging website. And if you have a free account, you can use this free staging websites for 24 hours, which is amazing. You can basically use them to test stuff and to tweak around and to, <laughs> to use WordPress, whatever, whatever way you want. And then, of course, you have to be careful here because in the free version, you just have a maximum of two websites that you can use on your plan. Then you have some limitation about disk space, one gigabyte, and you can only be the only solo team member of your account. Okay, so these are staging sites, simply, uh, and they are an expiration date, of course. If you want to make them permanent, you have to upgrade, of course. And let's see what else you can do with the free version. You can also build sites with AI. You have also here some limitations. Oh, yes, but it's quite impressive. So let's go here and give a name to our website. I will call this website oh, WP Roads. And this website is a website for tutorials about WordPress. And it will be an, an, an entrepreneur. <laughs> the language will be the English one. And then let's click on continue. Let's see what happens. Okay, here I will need to describe my website. Let's go on my actual website. Okay, and let's take, let's grab a couple of sentences, like for example, uh, this one, exploring the WordPress world with tutorials and reviews. Tutorial. <laughs> okay. okay, and once I have insert here my my description, I can also improve it using AI. Let's see what happens. <laughs> okay, let's click on continue and let's see what happens now. Okay, I have to provide my contact details. This I suppose they will be used on the website. Yes, this is exactly. These will be used on the website. So in the contact or the about page, for example, and we can use our contact details. Okay, phone number, I do not want to provide it and neither the address. If you want, you can also add some social media. I will add my YouTube channel. Okay, and now we're ready to continue. Let's see what happens. Okay, now it will ask me to select some relevant images as needed. And uh, as uh, in, at this moment, ZipWP, it is not able to create images from scratch. And so it will ask you just to uh, select some images right here to just yes, to show the AI the AI engine here, which is your taste. <laughs> and uh, you can also upload your images or selected images here. Okay. Uh, we can use this one, for example, we can go and add some more, some more keywords. Okay. This one, maybe this one. Yeah. This one too. Why not? This one too. This one too. Website creation. Okay. Let's see what happens here. I can add this one. Let's add a couple of pictures and voila. Okay, that's it. Let's continue. Okay, so I have selected nine images right now. I didn't want to, to upload my own images. And I I should need I should select here my preferred structure for the website. Okay, from some options below. So I just have some examples and I can go and uh, and have quick uh, yeah. A preview of some style and here if I go on the on the information I will see all the pages that will be included in my website and the plugins that will be installed with all this kind of website in this case spectra you see 
and let me see I must say for example that I like this one okay spectra and I have about five pages home about services blog and contact okay this looks good to me so I select this one I can also go oh this is good this is beautiful I can upload my site logo if I want I can manage here the fonts and the colors so I will go and choose for, uh, for example uh, this combination here I like it it changed the fonts to this one okay and then I can unlock premium design if I am on the f on the premium version but I'm not in on the premium tier so oh uh, no I don't want to unlock any access back to other designs oh that was a, that was a kind of um, a trap <laughs> that was an upsell trap how can I know which kind of template is included or not Maybe the first one is included. Yes, I should be included. This one at least. Okay. Let me go like this. Let me go like this and continue. Okay. This one is working. Okay. I can choose here if I want to install shortcut with donations or sale funnels. I, I, I imagine it will install another plugin like shortcut here. I imagine this one is presto player and, uh, Automation and integrations, I imagine it's short triggers and free live chat, I didn't test. Okay, let's test these uh, additional plugins or we, if you want, you can also skip and start building. But in my case, I will, I will just need to install these plugins. Okay, so this is a quick um, recap and I start building the website. Let's see, we will count together. One, two, three, four, can I have a little more? <laughs> Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I love you. Okay. Normally, it should take less than 60 seconds if we follow the ads on the website. The website says 60 seconds. Is it going to take 60 seconds? I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> Okay, I think we still are inside the 60 seconds, but we are kind of approaching the 60 seconds bar. Let's grab a cup of coffee. Mm. Okay, I don't know if that was 60 seconds, but anyway, this is quite impressive and quick and very fast. So I have my URL, I can view my website and I can have a password and a username to log in. Okay, view website. Mm -hmm. Enter OK. I will enter my OK, submit. And this is my website. Embark on your journey with WP Roads. Navigating the world of website creation with WP Roads, your trusted companion in the WordPress universe. Join us for expert tutorials and reviews. Join me because I'm a one man channel. <laughs> WP Roads about page. Okay, let's see here. This is quite interesting. I like it. Blog. Yes, this is good. Then I have the contact page. This is a contact form. And okay, and follow me on YouTube. It will bring me to my YouTube channel, which is awesome. Okay, let's go and see again the home page. Scroll down. This is quite good. I like it. And I also have some fake reviews. Great. <laughs> I can keep them here to make some. Uh... <laughs> okay, start your WordPress journey today. Explore now. Okay, perfect. This is good. I can go and see the blog. Just let me check here how blog posts are created. Okay. Yeah, very, very minimalistic yeah, structure. This is good. And let's see what happens in the back end. So let's go here WP Roads, WP Admin. <laughs> And these are the credentials. Let's see how it will work in the back end now. Okay, a bit crowded here. Oh uh, no, I do not want to save this. This is going to be inspire expiring in 24 hours because I have a free account on ZipWP. Okay, um, connect your plugins. No, I do not want to use short triggers. I just want to go here to plugins and see what happens. I have the 3CX live chat. I didn't know this plugin before. Okay, I, I need to set up a free account to make it work. And so it's a bit, yeah, I do not want this one to be activated on the website. I have press to player. Okay, this is good if I want to insert some good videos. Spectra, okay. I don't know why this is, 
already to update, I will update it, and I have show triggers. Okay, I do not need it, need it like right now, but just wanted to, sh to show you how it will look like when you choose to install some plugins into in during the website creation, pro creation process. So let's delete them. Okay, Spectra and the theme will be Astra. Okay, so into the appearance themes, I have Astra theme. Okay, hmm, good. And here into the appearance, we have also the zip WP option. Okay, which is, I bet it's different from the customizer you see, because if I go to the customizer, yes, I'm going to customize the website, but if I'm going to the zip WP, I can customize the website using the zip WP integration, which is kind of interesting approach. Yeah, this is great. I can change the color styling here. Wow, this is, this is well done. Yeah, yeah. I must say that this is very, very well, well constructed. Wow, impressive. Love it. And I can change also the font. Yeah, I can save and I can add my logo. I can, yeah, this is beautiful. This is very, very well done. Okay, I can change the look and feel of the website in a matter of seconds. And uh, one other thing I can do is when I create pages or if I edit existing pages like the about page, for example, I can use the beautiful integrated design library of Spectra. So. Um, let me check here, for example, if I want to change this call to action, I go to the design library and this is impressive, beautiful and awesome. This is my, personally my favorite feature about ZipWP and this design library integrates with ZipWP AI engine and it lets you, uh, yes, uh, basically preview everything in a dynamic way. So you can change colors, you see here, based on your color palette. You can change, uh, you can sync your library, which, what does it mean? I don't know. We have 1000 credits in our free account, perfect. And in the settings, we can update the details for the AI to suggest new texts and images. Okay, this is great. Here, I can simply go and tell this AI engine a more something more about my business, the name of the website. This website is for an entrepreneur. Uh, entrepreneur. <laughs> This is the description, continue, okay. And I will be able here to select some images maybe, or, okay, I'm stuck here. I don't know what happened. I reload the page, three, two, one, let's reload the page, yes. I think this is a good idea. <laughs> okay, let's go back to the design library now and let's see what happens here. Update images, okay. So here I can tell to use some new images. This one, yes, why not? This one, yes, this one, no, <laughs> this is not, this is not WordPress logo. <laughs> and uh, okay, save and exit. Okay, maybe this one is the feature that I need, the, the beautiful thunder. <laughs> yeah, if I try, for example, to go to the call to actions, yeah, and I go and use this feature, Yes, this will personalize the call to action patterns again. Okay, personalize 500 credits. Okay, it's a lot of credits. Okay, now they're using my images and my texts and my, yeah, my copy. You see, start the WordPress adventure today. Beautiful, wow, I love this. And if I go and sync my library, yeah, I don't know what does it mean, but maybe it's just going to sync my library with the actual, uh, yes, with the actual library of Spectra. Okay, so my call to actions now are all synced with my style. I can insert this one, for example, and voila, start your WordPress adventure today, today. Okay, so now let's go back to our ZipWP account. We go here, app zipwp.com. Okay, this is our, our plan. We're using two of two websites, okay, 22, 0 0.22 gigabytes. And uh, yeah, basically here we can see our staging websites. They both gone to Aspire in 24 hours, so we can just use them to make some quick tests. And of course, if we are happy with the stuff we are building, we can copy and paste them to whatever website we want. This is great. And uh, if I want to go and explore my projects, I have to upgrade, but projects are essentially some kind of tags that you can, or folders that you can use to group all your websites. And these are good if you have more than five or 10 websites to manage into your zip WP account. I hope so, I, I believe so. Blueprints, okay, I cannot see it right now. 
and this one we just saw it together. So this is the free version of ZipWP. It's kind of a starting point to get to know this plugin. I think it's quite interesting. Let me know what you think about this in the comment section below. And I hope to see you in the next video. And right now you can click here on the two videos that will appear here or here, I don't know, anyway, here on my sides, on my left and right side. And I hope that you like this video and that you can subscribe, hit, light, hit the like button and see you in the next video. Ciao. <laughs>